Hello, today I'm going to show you guys how to download Minecraft Bedrock Launcher. And so first, this is the Bedrock Launcher's GitHub homepage. And from here, you can press download and it prompt up a prompter that says, uh, this doesn't pirate Minecraft. This is based off of your actual copy of Minecraft. So you have to own it. It could be through Game Pass, so, and yeah. So then it gives you a pop-up that sends you to its actual GitHub uh, like releases. From here, you scroll down and you get the zip file. Uh, from here, you double click this and you have to extract it. Then, when you do that, you want to go to the Bedrock Launcher and you want to try to launch it with Administrator. Now, that's good. What will happen for you guys is that oh, it's give a prompter uh, requesting that you download the Windows Desktop Runtime 8.0.20. What it would look like is will be prompted up to your screen is this after pressing the button. This is going to automatically install, or not automatically install, but automatically send you the installation for .NET 8.0 desktop runtime. You need this to use it. You need this for Bedrock Launcher. So then you download this. It will give you a, let me reset this. It will give you the file name and you save, and then you run this, already exists. So uh, I already did this. I go to my uh, downloads, my download file. I double click this. It'll give you this. Mine's already installed, but what you want to do, you want to install yours. And then once it's installed, you press like a, okay, whatever. And then from there, you want to go back to Bedrock Launcher. And then you want to run as an administrator. Then you'll get to this, this part. And it tells you to log in. You just have to make a name. Then you go, go past here, go past here. No, it's finished, blah, blah, blah. So this is an installation. Now, what you want to do to play older versions, you want to go to installations, new installation, and then you get to pick one. It goes all the way down to 0.14.0.1, but I don't, I've not gotten this to work, but I have gotten to 0.14.2 to work in the past. I don't know if it wants to right now though. Doesn't want to work? It worked. So now you could play old Minecraft. You're able to, oh, you're able to look like a barmaid now. Look at that. I can't even move around my thing, that's how old it is. Got languages and everything. And this is how you play old Minecraft. But, some people, if you're having problems installing and it's giving you like a developer thing, what you want to do is want to go to settings, find a settings, you want to type in developer properly. And then you want to go to more developers. So again, type in developer and press developer settings. And then you want to enable developer mode. For some reason, modern installations of Windows has this as a like setting that you need to turn on. Keep this on. This is something that you're going to use a lot. Just don't install viruses and you're good. Also, I like to enable end task, but that's just me. So if all if you did all that and got to this point and it's still not working, you have to make sure that you have like Minecraft installed, the official Minecraft. So if you need that installed, you need to go to Microsoft Store and get the Minecraft, like the actual Minecraft launcher, not the Bedrock one. So you go to Minecraft Launcher, not Minecraft for Windows. And then you install this. You're able to do it through the PC Game Pass, Xbox, all that. But you need to be on this and signed in. It will not work unless you're signed in onto the actual Minecraft launcher. I hope you guys have a good day. Thank you for watching.